move and generation of thrombin. If your heart time is slow or long or deficient, you need a source of thrombin, you need plasma. Once you make thrombin, you start to cleave fibrinogen to fibrin, and fibrin sticks your platelets together. It's that process that makes clot, it's that process that, call, that causes the curve to diverge, and that is known as the alpha angle or the K time. If those angles are bad or the time is slow, you need fibrinogen, you need cryoprecipitate. And then finally, the width to which those two separate regards the strength of the clot. And the strength of the clot is formulated by fibrinogen, now fibrin, sticking platelets together. If you don't own platelets, it doesn't matter how much fiber you have, you'll have a weak clot. So if you have a low mean amplitude here, you need platelets. It's that simple. I look over my shoulder. In Cincinnati, the highest level of alert patients, the trauma stats, routinely, by mandate, get a tape drawn automatically. So that if I'm in the operating room, this you will see this curve completed at 25 minutes. Well, trauma bay, sick, operating room, I'm already at 18 minutes when I'm trying best of worlds, usually at 30 when I'm in the operating room, I can look over my shoulder at the tank screen and I can, with my anesthesiologist can already say, geez, the R time's already out, let's keep on pushing the plasma. Well, the K time's bad, let's get some cryo right off the way. So we look at INR only to screen